Hello YouTube fam, how y'all doing? It's your Uncle Tim. This is Uncle Tim Rants and Reviews, the channel where I ran and I review. Today, we was at the Target and they had street dated toys. You know, toys that don't supposed to be out to a certain time. These don't supposed to go out to the 26th. They had the Trouble Bubble, Python Patrol. You look in the community section, there's pictures of it, man. And I was looking at it and I said, man, I didn't know it was uh, street dated. I was thinking I could get both of them. And use both of them because I said I wanted displayed up in here. I said I could get the stands to put them on to make it look like they flying because this guy is selling them that I know. And I'm like, damn, you know, I said this would be cool. I was looking at some of the Joes that they had. Uh, you know, they had the Car Packs for eleven ninety nine. They had uh, what's that big old robot? Uh, the Bat Mo the Bat the giant robot for Batman that looks almost like the Hulkbuster man. But I was looking at it; it wasn't on sale though. But I was looking, and they had uh, I think that Night Batman. Um, he had a sword, and he man, he was looking sharp as hell. Man, they had some. Oh, they had a whole bunch of Hush Batman. Man, I almost fell out. I said, ain't this some shit? I said, you couldn't find a Hush Batman. Now you see like three of them on the shelf, man. And I'm like, wow. I was looking at the collector section at Target. And this was out in Lamont. The area was just crowded with shit, man. It was just shit everywhere. I mean, they had so much. It was just chugged full of merchandise. They also had these Mega Blocks Hot Wheels. Don't you know how Lego got the cars and stuff like that? Hot Wheel got cars and that, but they using Mega Blocks. Man, they looking smooth as hell. These look more put together than the actual Legos, man. You know, I'm looking, they had like uh, Mr. Perfect from wrestling. You know, that's the first time I seen Mr. Perfect at a Target. I know a lot of you all see Mr. Perfect. But see, a lot of the stuff that you see in your area, I don't see in mine, man. And I was just looking. There was just shit galore. <coughs> Um, they had some, um, what did they have? The Masters of the Universe stuff, man. It's, that's the thing that kills me, man. I was looking for, uh, you know, I've been looking for Buzz Off and Faker for Masterverse for the longest, man. And I was trying to see if they had any. You know, they had Slushhead, Clawful, Ram Man, uh, that new Skeletor for, uh, the new adventures of He-Man. And I was just sitting there thinking to my damn self, I don't know. I don't know if I want to pick that up. You know, I'm like, this is not, you know, I don't need 40 million Skeletors. I'm just being honest. I don't, you know, I don't need 40 million He-Mans. I only need the He-Mans and Skeletors that I actually want. Um, I was looking at everything that they had. I was looking at the turtles. They were jam packed. The Hot Wheel displays, they were pretty good. They had the big old sets. They had the crab, they had the uh, the crocodile, they had the gorilla. Dude, I was over there, I had them all checking all of those damn things. They were like 18 a piece. I was like, damn, I gotta put this back. And this one that I was looking at was, no, I think they were like, yeah, they all were like 18 a piece. And I was like, no, nah, I gotta put these back. But I was just thinking about everything, the way it worked, and I said, man, we just gotta make this shit work somehow. We gotta put this together, you know, and see where we're going to go from there, man. I'm like, man, kind of liking what I'm saying, man. You know, I'm like, yeah, they're doing it here. So as we left there, which I think that was the second stop, the first stop was the Goodwill Benz, man. And, you know, we looked, I seen some Blu-rays, but my wife was like, no, we got those. We got that one. We got this one. No, let's leave that alone. She said, I know we got these. So I put those back, you know, um, I was disappointed this time, just like my wife was. She said, you know, I guess, you know, the week before was like grand opening weekend. And, you know, they just kept bringing stuff out and stuff was fire. They had box sets. They had this. They had that. And she said, as you look at it now, you don't really see anything. You're looking at stuff that don't make sense. All the stuff that you got right now, you're looking at like, eh. Like they steady filling it like with just, eh. You know, you see people in there, they, they got carts and carts of clothes. They, I guess they know what they're looking for. They looking through the clothes, they find and stuff, and, you know, they see them at the front door. They done pay for their stuff. They look and say, oh, man, I got this, I got that. You know, carts of shit, you know, clothes. You see people that had uh, carts of purses, and I'm like, yeah. You know, my wife was like, yeah, see, that's what I'm talking about right there. 
What I'm talking about to a lot of you all is, you know, you got to make this shit work for you. It ain't about how it's working for any damn body else, but for you. And that's the thing that, you know, I'm trying to trickle down to a lot of people. Hey, you got to make it work for yourself. It ain't about everybody else. It ain't about how everybody else want it. It's about how you want it and how you want it set up. You know, in the process, you got to do you, man. You know, so we're in there looking through the hard goods. We're looking through um, media, uh, books, and everything, man. And I'm looking, like I said, two DVDs. We got some books, uh, some uh, glassware, and that was it. Walgreens, um, they had some stuff, but, you know, Walgreens is full price right now. So there wasn't no sales. You know, I was looking at the tickets. You know, I didn't see anything that said sale. So I didn't get opportunity to go to Ross and things like that. You know, we got out, making a move, you know, just moving around. And at the end, end up, like I said, at Target, I got like seven plastic totes, room essentials, to put like... Uh, the various action figures in that I got that I could open a box and just put up. So I was thinking I'm going to put up the stuff far as like uh, the Marvel Legends, uh, the DC Multiverse stuff, uh, the G.I. Joe Classified, Masters of the Universe, the Fortnite stuff, you know, just stuff that uh, <laughs> that I could get easy access to, you know separate the totes you know got the hot wheel totes because i got like four or five of those or six you know i got everything separated that way i could say well if i'm looking for this it's in this tote all the gi joes in this tote all the blah 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 is in that tote man so i'm just trying to make this work you know so i'm trying to make things easier for myself you know i moved out the the gi joe oral or rig and you know those uh what are those called uh Sky Strikers, the incomplete stress, Sky Strikers, I got two, and I got a black mumba, I think, or something like that, it's purple and black, it's like a helicopter, I don't know, I think I'm gonna do giveaways on that stuff, man, it's two of the oil rigs, they're not complete, two of them are missing legs, at least one leg that you could get off of eBay and some other pieces, like I say, you gotta make your stuff work for yourself, you know, at the end of the day, all of this is about you, man, like I said, I'm slowly but surely piecing stuff together. Like I said, I don't know if I said it. I'm going to show Cologne uh, collection. I'm going to show the watch collection. It's not that many. I think it's like three or four. <laughs> um, but, you know, to me, it's a collection. Uh, I'm going to show the hats. Um, I'm going to show the Switch games that I um, got to this point, man. Because, like I said, those those are adding up, man. You know, um my wife seen deals on them, and she's like, man, I could pick up some of this stuff for you for Christmas. And, you know, I was like, damn. You know, she was looking at an OLED switch for me because I want a switch that I could put on a TV. You know, I don't want that, you know, don't get me wrong. I like this. But I don't know nowhere to connect this to the TV. You know, I want it whereas I could put it on a TV, play it on a TV, man. That's the fun part to me. You know, actually playing it on the TV. That's what a lot of people don't get. And that's the thing that I was talking about to a lot of people. That's what will make this fun to me. But you know what? I'm going to actually get one for the TV and we're going to call that quits on that. Um, and I don't know what I do with this one. I don't know. Maybe I keep it. Or maybe that wouldn't be up for like a giveaway that someone would have to pay shipping on. <laughs> Certain things I ain't gonna pay shipping on, man. That one I wouldn't mind, but you don't want to pay shipping on everything when you're doing everything for people. <laughs> um, yes, um, those um, Spin Masters, I think. Spin Master, Trend Master, Somebody Master. They're still $19.99 at... Um, Target, the big back wing ship, the bat wing, the gigantic one, man. $19.99, that's still a good deal, 20 bucks. Man, you know what? Enjoy what you're doing, have fun. You know, these things don't last. You know, all of these deals and steals that we talk about, you get them while you can, enjoy them while you can. Keep on moving, keep on living, keep doing you. Kaleida fam, thank you so much for watching, <laughs> man. 
it's it's been something, man. I I, I just don't know. I I think I want to move more stuff out. I don't know, but to lay the peace out.